Y'all, thank God for subtle lighting. I'm just gonna drink this with my top on. Oh, thank God. Just how long can something that says Best Buy April 20, 2023, how long can that stay in the freezer? Okay, guys, I've gotten much better about eating things up, and I'm going through my freezer looking for things. Um, so this is called Stone's Throw Foods Wakey Wakey Apple Bacon Skillet, a flavorful blend of red potatoes, bacon, apples, and onions, a good source of protein. I think it was on sale at my giant, you know, if you from my giant or <coughs> they have um, on their app new items, right? So I always look at that. And maybe though it's local, founded in 2019 as a food truck on the streets of Baltimore. Okay. So they tend to, I don't see anything really bad in it. Um, and I cooked mine in the oven, not the oven, on the stove. But what's interesting is, um, can you all see that? That's kind of what it looks like. So it's got, I, I took a bite and I thought, ooh, what's happening? And it has an apple in it. So that just kind of threw me off. It's okay, I think apple's different. I'm not sure I would buy it. I think it was more on the pricey side. I'm just gonna have a little bit. And then I have a Clamato. Y'all, I have a fried egg. So, let me have a bite of this. I might, if I see it again, just get it and then make it that day or the next day or something, but it's different. So if you're making your own potatoes, throw in a little bacon, throw in some tiny cut up, um, it's Fuji apples. Yeah, probably would taste better if I'd eaten it close to April last year, this year, last year. Um, anyway. Okay, you guys. Yes. I had to stop and rate everything on Yucca. This is an issue. This is what I don't and do anymore. I don't buy just because, oh, I see that. Oh, maybe I could use it. Now, I like them by my bed, in my bathroom, in the kitchen, wherever I am. I want some of this. Every coat pocket, I want some of this. At work, car. <sighs> Are there any healthy lip balm? All right. Let's see. So let's go. There's some that are not as bad as others, right? Um, so let's start with the beloved um, chapstick. So this is classic cherry. <clears throat> like I said, my brother either got original or in the black or the classic cherry. Never been my favorite chapstick. Um, uh, and sometimes, you know, I just don't like weird um, smells, right? Anyway, did that keep me? Let's see. Uh, how many chapsticks do I have? It's a bit crazy. Um, but the good thing now is I know better and I'm going to do better. Is this it? And trust me, there's probably some hidden. Oh, my God. So we have cotton candy. Love this one. Vanilla Latte, another great one. Holiday Cocoa was good. Strawberries, okay. They don't do as well with the berries. Um, another cotton candy, another cherry. Then I have two other sugar cookie. No, I have sugar cookie, pumpkin pie, and cot two cotton candies. So, you know, you get them in sets. These are a zero out of 100, y'all. A zero out of 100. Petroleum. It's called Petrolatem or something. It's petroleum. And that's something I got to come to terms with because I like baby oil. There's some things I like that have it in it. And I haven't had, I've had a hard time trying to replace my baby oil in the shower. But you guys, I mean, trying to be healthy, eat healthy, work out, meditate, do fun things. And then this stuff literally 
goes into your, I mean, I eat it off my lips, you know? I mean, I eat this off my lips. It's just how it is. So, it's got to go. A zero, out, who wants to put a zero out of 100 <coughs> on your lips? Nobody. Hazardous. So hazardous, it's a zero out of 100. So, that's going. And then, you know, by default, um, oops, here's another one. This is just the moisturizing one, a zero. Um, let's see here. Where are this one? Now, I love these. I give the, I used to give these all the time. Oh, here's another chapstick, passion fruit, y'all. That's not open. Um, we're going to throw Crayola. Oh, Crayola. So, the, I mean, yeah. Tickle me pink cotton candy. So, we have Frankenberry. We have, um, this is Icebreaker's Cool Mint. We have Cookie Crisp. So, you get these in a package, like at Five Below or Big Lots, Target, everywhere really, right? Especially around the holidays. Dollar Tree, Fanta Grape, or is that Fanta Orange? And Lucky Charms, y'all. Hazardous, hazardous, geared towards children, geared towards your kids. I mean, I've given many of these to friends. And then let's see. So here is let's here's where the sadness comes in. But now I know better. I'm gonna do better. Vanilla mint chopstick. Remember the day you could just get cherry and you could get plain. These are my all-time favorite, and I know they're everywhere. So, I know I have more than two. <coughs> Dollar Tree. It is salt range, Himalayan pink salt. That sounds good, y'all. Himalayan pink salt's healthy. Moisturizing lip balm. Um, cherry Shea. It's a four. It's a four out of 100. And what these things have in them, besides the petroleum, is they have um, something called, okay, O-C-T-I-N-O-X-A-T-E, octinone, which is a, um, a possible carcinogen, right? Then we have, or maybe that, no, petroleum is a carcinogen, but that and benzofemanon are endocrine disruptors, y'all. Endocrine disruptors, I'm not sure what that means. Somebody will tell me, but I don't need it disrupted. I got enough disruption. I don't need to put something on my mouth that's going to disrupt my endocrine. Just saying. So this is sad. And I really love this stuff. And it's um, cherry and shea butter. It's going. I'm not putting a four on my lips. My precious lips. Okay, well, you know, we've all had... Um, let's see. No, no, not yet. Um, so this one, soft lips. Soft lips, y'all. Peach passion. The peach passion of it all. Look at that cute little thinner kind of thing, right? Look at that. Yep, I've been using it. It is a zero. It's got all that terrible stuff in it. The petroleum, the extinone, the benzenophene stuff, gone. So then let's move into... So, okay, this is hard, y'all. This one's hard. As you can see... And I know I have more. And I really suffered because I took them out of my car. I took them out of my pocket. I took them away. And I've been like in my car trying to find something. There might be one in my bag. But these are CarMax. And one of the things my mom and I would run in when she, back in the day is she wanted some of this. And they always had it. So this has all the terrible stuff in it. It soothes. It heals. It protects. It poisons. They forgot that. It poisons you. That is so sad, but it's a zero. But not only does it have those other three, the petroleum, the other two things I'm not, it also has something called BHT, which I know they've taken that out of things. I don't quite understand it, but that's throwing that thing, BHT too. It's a hard one, but they have to go. Now the question is, some of these aren't open. Do I give them away? I mean, do I just trash them? I hate throwing, you know, it's hard, I get it. Like, I'm like, I'm not going to be like, oh, I'm going to use these up and then not get them again. Heck no. Zeros out of 100? That's just awful. So let's go to some of these that are not as bad as others, right? 
Um, but they're not great. Are there any good ones? So this one, I can't remember what it is, but it's not as bad as some of No, I think this was bad. So it smells good. Blistex Deep Renewal Anti-Aging Treatment, y'all. It's kind of anti-age. You know, I still have fine lines, but you're going to pay for it. It says Coenzyme Q10 Formula. I mean, what does that mean? It smells good. I like the, because you know, some of them I can't stand the taste. Okay. So what are we getting into here? Let me find the ones that will go from. Okay. All right, so this one is a 22. So this is Blitex, Blistex Five Star Lip Protection Broad Spectrum SPF 30. So these that had the SPF have that stuff in it. Um, I'm going to let it go because I don't like the taste of it. This one called O'Keefe's Lip Repair Lip Balm. Long Lasting Hydration. This is a 24. It's nothing hazardous, but it's still poor, right? There's still stuff in there that a 24 out of 100, when it comes to your lips, is, um, it says, for best results, apply to lips as needed. Stop use if irritation occurs. Really, y'all? You have to be told to stop use if it's irritating. Okay. Y'all give you permission for the rest of your life that something's irritating, whether it's a man, a lip balm, you can stop use. Okay? You can. So that's going. So our next one is 30. So Nivea Smoothness Broad Spectrum 15 Sun Care. So I think the ones that have the stuff in it for um, blocking out the sun has whatever that, can't think of the name of it. This, this is interesting. One's blue and one's white, y'all. What's that about? Oh, one's mint and minerals and one is smoothness. So I don't know which one. I think I checked the mint and minerals. Anyway, it's not good enough. They're going. Will I ever have lip stuff again? Here's an old, here's a goodie, right? Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula Original. Um, SPF 15, vitamin E. This is actually getting closer. It's a 37 out of 100. Y'all, I mean, as you can see, we like our lip balm. Um, not good enough. I'm gonna eat it off. What's the point of that? I don't want that. So that's going. Actually, you know what? I should put all these. And I really mean they're going. I'm not. I just, I'm thinking, you know, my brain's fighting me. Well, yeah, but it's not that bad. You don't use it that often. Really? Brain? What are you talking about? Okay. So here we are. Um, my CarMax. My beloved CarMax. That one. And this one is a 30. So this is Nivea. Oh, that's the one I just showed you. So they're going. So the good thing about um, yucca, it gives you suggestions, right? It gives you suggestions um, of things that are good. Now I haven't bought yet. I have one, but I think I left it on my desk at work. Hundred is Aquaphor. Hundred out of hundred, Aquaphor. So I'm gonna get some at Walmart. And I'll show it to you when I get it. I'm gonna get a bunch of it. Um, 100 out of 100, y'all, why are you going to get some of this nonsense when you get 100 out of 100 that you're going to put on your children's lips, your lips, your husband? I mean, really think about it. And I eat it off. I mean, me and lipstick. So, Aquaphor, which I don't have. Now, this one rated super high, too. I think, was it 100 out of 100? Good old Trader Joe's. So, I... They show, so these are all the ones you get in a kit usually, you know, like at Christmas. Um, so almond cream, I got green tea, um, two almond creams, a raspberry cream, and watermelon. Let's try the almond. I love almond, y'all. Remember toasted almond ice cream bars? You can't find them. The good humor, you can't find them anywhere. It's okay. I mean... So these, I don't know if they sell like individual. I, they probably would sell this again around the hot. Um, I know Christmas they have that little pack. 
So I have to check which one they come out with this summer. So there's no SBF in it. Again, external use only. Wow. It would be interesting if someone put together complaints. Continue if redness or irritation occurs. Keep out of the reach of children. Y'all keep out of the reach of children. But again, do you have to be told when something irritates you? Okay. And then the other one that rates high is Burt's Bee. Good old Burt's Bee, y'all. So I don't remember I rated it before, but it's a hot, they're good. Lip balm with pink grapefruit, 100% natural. So that's our other choice. Um, I thought I had a napkin, y'all. Never have one when I need one. All right, I'm going to be very uncouth. So I feel like I have more of these. I'm just not sure they're at. Mm, it's yummy. Refreshing lip balm with pink grapefruit. So these are your choices that I've seen so far, right? Or Trader Joe's, Burt's Bee, and Aquaphor. Aquaphor, I'm going to um, buy myself some Aquaphor, and I might buy another Burt's Bees. But I do have to look for, and if y'all know some, because I know you all are on your game with the health stuff, if you can tell me a good one that has an SPF that's healthy, because that's so important. Um, but that is my take on that. And this is, um, I tease je ne sais quoi, right? And I couldn't find any information on this one. And I tease it got mixed. So soft. And it's supposed to change your colors to like a natural color. So y'all let me know. Do you know anything about that? Je ne sais quoi, IT. We used to get a lot of this on um, QVC. And I did like, so the next hunt I'm on for is a makeup. Uh, um, you know, like a, just something that, you know, evens out my skin tone, covers up some of my dark spots, that kind of thing. I, yeah, I'm not looking for my skin to look 21, y'all. Don't have enough money and don't have a time machine. <laughs> so, but I just want some that covers it, is comfortable, is not full of toxins. Apparently, is that a lot? Y'all beware, buyer, beware. Beware of your lip balm, go check it now. And Yucca, it's free. Anything that has a barcode, you can scan for free. Now, if you do have to pay if you want to search by like, this didn't have, it probably has a code on it when you buy them together, but each one doesn't. So I put it in by, you know, I just typed it in. And um, so if you guys have something and there's no barcode um, and you don't want to pay for Yucca, but I think it's, it's not that much and it's a great investment, but you can um, contact me or put in the comments and I'll do it for you and tell you what. With what the the four one one is on it or the nine one one, we're gonna do hand lotion or no hand lotions. This is paint. <laughs> I have this in there too. It's glue, y'all. Anyone <coughs> who does art and knows, like you have lip balm glue, you have tea, you have water. You gotta be careful. Let's have some coffee, y'all. So this is the kind of thing I'm doing today. I'm clearing up my table. So this is like I wanted to do this with y'all. So. Some pictures for Instagram and off into the trash. And these, so my little, these will be distributed throughout my house, my coats, that kind of thing, because I've been dying without it. And Aquaphor, yeah, it, I know. Well, I'm sure everyone has it. Um, <clears throat> I didn't check Amazon, but since I'm gonna do a Walmart haul, um, Aquaphor. All right, just a little information, just you know. When you add it all up, no wonder there's so much, it seems like more autism, ADHD, just different problems. You know, people having a hard time getting pregnant or or just, you know, chronic fatigue, all this stuff going on. And you think of how we're bombarded, right? My grandma didn't have to put up with this stuff, right? I mean, they had other things, um, but it just seems like if you start your shower and you use a shampoo that's toxic. Now I've been using native. Love it. It's so much. My big thing is 10 bucks y'all. That's like, please. My other shampoo is $30. Love it. Um, I might buy a new flavor cause I'm, or new cause I'm getting down and it's pump. Love the pump. So that's now that I've changed. So it's not toxic anymore. Then you have a body wash, right? So your, your pores are open. You're putting toxins in your body that way. Now I have, um, I did get, without checking it, y'all watch the Joes. The Trader Joes, not everything is great. Well, we all know that, but what's that thing everyone's, the Brazilian butt cream, that's not the name. But anyway, people are obsessed with it, it comes in the pink. I did buy um, 
I give that out all the time because I just love the smell. But y'all, it's not one of their, it's not super friendly. So I do have one of those. And then I've got, I'm keeping that. Why? Right? Um, but I've gotten rid of a lot of others. So like Dove is a good one, but not all Doves are the same, right? They've repackaged and they reinvented and stuff like that. So scan it on Yucca because it will have when you're in the store and just see, see what you're putting in your body. Just we're talking about on your body, right? Not even what you're eating. So then now my big problem is I love um, baby oil. I've been using baby oil like as a, the end just to put on my body. And that's not good because it's got petroleum. And I'm having a hard time with that, which makes me sad because I'm putting it in my open pores. So I did buy some, Burpees has a really good lemon one and Honest Brand has a lemon one. They're more expensive, but you know what? I think I have to go back to it and just use a little because why am I gonna put? So if I get rid of that and use something else, then my whole shower, there's no toxins coming in my body. That's a gift you can give yourself, right? But then, hey, let's brush our teeth. What's your toothpaste like, right? Then your face cream. Now listen, I've tried face creams and I'm still using the IT until I find something better. That is a toss up between feeling good. So y'all let me know. There was one I got at Costco and I didn't like it. Um, can't think of the name of it. That's a normal brand. Like Jergens, but it's not Jergens. It's like Olay, something like that. Don't like the smell of it. I don't like the feel of it. So that, so that I still have to look for. And then, um, you know, God knows what you're spraying on your hair. What's in those gels? What's in that? I have something that I sprayed from the blow dry. What's in that, y'all? I haven't tested it out yet. Right? And then what are you drinking for, you know, coffee? With I have my oat creamer, you know, that's still got some sugar in it. So yeah, and you just go boom, boom, boom. What are you grabbing for breakfast? You know, it's amazing. Some of these frozen things have terrible things in them, you know? So it's hard. It's like so much to be aware of, much less you're working, hustling, cleaning, laundry, dishes, everything's expensive. So, but I thought I need to work on at least what I'm, I'm working on what's in my body, but what goes on my body, right? And... I don't know why this is killing me. I mean, I don't know. My mom, this, she would, it didn't matter. She'd be like, I'm using it. But look at this. This is a chunk of money too, y'all. But anything I know now that has a food dye, I don't, you know, like I, I can't imagine eating Fruit Loops again. I can't imagine eating um, Lucky Charms again. So I eat my rise, my um, post raisin nut brand. That's my favorite. So now cereal is not, when you have cereal like that, it's a treat, right? It's not nutrients but i'm gonna work this week on trying to get more nutrients in my body but yeah thank you let me know are you on yucca i i can't remember who told me about yucca now someone here thank you very much that's the great thing i share you share and um that's what makes the world go round y'all but yeah let me know and again if there's something you want to know and you don't you know you just have the basic and you there's no code put it in the comments and i will look it up for you and let you know but yeah, so that's what's going on. So thank you so much. I'm having a day. I'm just clearing up things, doing little videos. Um, I'm going to try to get my table cleared. As God is my witness, my table will be cleared. And then I'll put the art I want to work on today on there. So, okay, guys, you take care. I appreciate you so much. And if you're new, thank you so much. And please subscribe. I'd like to get to a thousand and then I would like to get to like world dominance numbers and I can't do it without you and the comments. I'm getting back in the groove of doing my comments. It's been a hard year with my ADHD medicine not working and not getting it and just sort of coming back to myself, even though this new stuff is not hundred percent. I got to work out more with my doctor. It's expensive. So I don't know what's going to happen, but right now, you know, I, it's just been a year so comments mean everything to me. So I'm working on that. And, you know, I'm trying to do more stuff to make my channel findable, that kind of thing, put more time in it. Um, I got to do thumbnails, stuff like this, but I will. And um, it's fun. It's, the thing is, a lot of stuff I want to do. And I'm trying to change my language, y'all. I have to do housework. Now, I get to do housework. Like, I have to do dishes. And I get to do dishes. When you think about, you know, you have food and, you know, how lucky you are. And you sat at your kitchen table. And, you know, I'm trying to move into gratitude and away from things feeling like a burden. And that's just a mindset that I got this year from all the just traumas of this stuff. 
So yeah, so think about it. Try to change your language from I have to do dishes to I get to do dishes. Like I have to go to work. No, I get to go to work. So I'm working on that. I think language is important. And y'all, I haven't talked about this yet too much, but yeah, ask your angels for help. Whether you believe it or not, you're like, okay, I'm turning this off. No, ask your angels for help. Why not? What do you have to lose, right? No one's gonna be like, oh, that woman over there is asking angels for help. What's wrong with her? You know, what's right with her? So y'all, kind of cool if I could have my hair color like that. Wouldn't that be something with the stripes? All right, I'm gonna let you go. I'll talk to you soon. And yeah, yucca, what the hell are you putting on your body?